A Silver Lake man suffering from terminal cancer plans to take his own life in a few weeks. And he has the support of a new California law. A KCO 9's Tom Waits spoke with Bob Stone about his decision to die with dignity. Uh, Tom joins us now live in the newsroom with his story tonight. Tom? Yeah, Jeff, Stone will be among the first to take his own life under the new California law. He already has the prescribed deadly cocktail of medicine, and he says it's just a matter of time. Bob Stone wants to explore his entire music library, but he's running out of time. The 69-year-old plans to take his own life in six weeks. It's death with dignity. That's, that all, it's a peaceful death. That, it's about choice. That's all it is. It's giving people options and choices. And what's wrong with that? Stone is dying of bone marrow cancer. He was diagnosed 15 months ago and was given a year, maybe two, to live. But instead of worrying about a slow, painful end, Bob is able to take his own life legally under the new California law. For me, it's an existential question about how I live my life and how I die and how I have the right to make those decisions. Stone is at peace with his decision and his family is on board too. But groups like the California Pro-Life Council are opposed to the law, calling it a violation of medical ethics. On Bob's case, a spokesman said this, I hope Stone has had a psychological intervention as there is none required under California law and suicidal depression is not uncommon when given terminal diagnoses. I'm quite sane. <laughs> and... <laughs> I know what I'm doing. Stone is focused on the important things. It's funny, getting a dire diagnosis may seem like a terrible thing, but really um, it's given me some time to reflect on my life and focus on the things that uh, are important to me. On Stone's bucket list, more music, a little travel, and some time with family and friends. And get this, he wants to make sure his garage is cleaned out. <laughs> Jeff and Susie, back right, to you this week.